going on everybody welcome back to the channel so in today's video we will be installing window visors now i had previously taken off the old ones because i knew i was going to be putting these on today and i really need to clean these up before i install the new ones there's still some adhesive here that i have to take off on this side look at how bad that is that's just that's horrible oh my god what is that let's get started actual visors I went ahead and I picked up some flat black wrap now this is gonna go on the window pillars which are extremely faded and hopefully if all goes well the flat black wrap will just cover over it I mean the coverage is really and I don't have to see that so that way once the visors are on it will look OEM the other side is actually not that bad honestly I could probably get away with it, but I'm actually gonna wrap both sides because I don't really like how this chipping is. First things first, we're gonna clean the outside of the windows and then we're gonna start putting on the visors. Okay, so all the way around, I wrapped the pillars. As you can see, I'm not the greatest rapper. But looks good for me. Check the other side. And this side is good as well. I was just mainly concerned about the faded top area. So now that we got that out of the way, we have our window visors, and these are OEM Honda visors. There it is right there. And you also have your clips with part numbers. So I think the first step that you have to do is take this trim down so you can fit the clips inside. I'm gonna do that now, set you guys down. Hopefully the camera does not overheat. I'll come back to you guys as soon as I get the clips put in. driver's side window you want to go ahead and put your clips in the channel here um, of the window so you're going to want to peel this back and place the clips one in the front and one in the back um, and these will align with the holes that are on the actual visor so you got one here and you got one in the back now as far as the rears, it's pretty much essentially the same thing. And then you have the push clips. This hook right here, I believe has to go, I wanna say around the edge of that clip there. So what I'm gonna do is put you guys down. Just go ahead and put the visor on, peel off the 3M tape and yeah, just pretty much throw them on, see how they look. First one is in, real simple. I did have to adjust the clips on the back, but it's pretty sturdy. I try to make it line up as even as possible. Obviously there is a little space for the door because the other one would be sitting right here. So as far as that, I just tried to line it up with the top body line of the window. And also this hook here 
should be in place as well. So make sure when you're putting it on, this hooks around and everything should be secured. Looks great. Now I'll come back to you guys as soon as everything is finished. So after a long, I think I want to say about an hour, hour and a half of wrapping the pillars and putting the visors on, they are finally on. I still have to clean them up, but, and they look really, really good. Definitely look way better than the other ones that I had on before. And like I said, I do have to wipe these off but that is pretty much it guys i hope you enjoyed today's video i apologize the camera kept overheating i really don't have control of that over the heat so if you guys haven't already subscribe to the channel i really appreciate all your guys' support and comments and questions i got another video coming up for the jdm hazard button so stay tuned for that thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video peace